Hi, in this video, I will show you how to create these five tight dust sprays. First, I create the part lines. You need a total of five sections like this. This is how the left side looks, then I create the same to the right side. Once you parted the both sides like this, you got the fifth section on the middle. Before starting the braid, I wet the hair so it's easier to braid. Then I take the small piece of hair and separate it in three pieces. Start to print strands under the middle one from each side. Add hair from the both sides of the braid. When you braid, is the most important thing that the strand you are moving is as tight as possible. So before you start to move the hair strand, tighten it before you do it. Then add hair and tie it again. Then you can release it so it's easier to focus on one strand at a time. You just need to remember to pull the strand tight before you start to move it again. Pattern is pretty simple, so take the right strand, bring it under, add hair. Then the left strand under, add hair. Right strand under, add hair. Left strand under, add hair. Right strand under, Add hair, left strand under, add hair. Keep on repeating this pattern until you braided the whole section into the braid. After the last adding, keep on braiding until the end of the hair. Repeat the same pattern to the all five sections. Every time you need three strands and then you start to braid by moving strands from sides under to the middle. Add hair from the both sides of the braid. And don't forget to tie the strand before you add more hair.
When I create this last fifth braid from directly from front to backwards, I hold the strands a little bit different. I don't actually know why, but I just used to do like this. So when I do the braids from front to back, I hold the strands with my ring finger and little finger. Then I add hair and with this technique I don't need to tie the strands as much as usual but I still do to make sure that it will be tight. The difference is that basically when I do the braids on sides I keep one strand, only one strand tight but on this version I keep both side strands pretty tight all the time and only the middle strand, that one I moved the last time, is loosened. But basically it's just the same technique. I move the strands from sides under to the middle and add hair from the both sides of the braid. This is just how I'm used to do it and Personally, I think that there's no wrong and right answers for this. So do it the way that it's best for you. Here's the final result of this hairstyle. Thank you for watching this video. Hopefully you like it. Have a great day.